Good day all. This is a video response to Stig of the Dump, um, who did a Old Hammer High Elf army. Uh, and these, these are my Dark Elves, or what's left of them. This is about a third of what I originally had in Dark Elves. Uh, but I did sell them all. I sold these as well on eBay, but the guy that bought them, after about four weeks, decided he no longer wanted them. Um, and we'll go into that. I'll have a bit of a rant about that <laughs> as we go on. Uh, so these are my Cold War Knights. Uh, I think I had 20 of them originally. Not in this sale. There was only these in this sale. Although, there's this one as well. I hadn't finished the base on, but it did have a rider. Uh, but the rider's missing. Don't know what happened to him. He just didn't get him back. Uh, this is one of the dangers of selling on eBay. That I'll go into in a minute. So that's cold one night. Um, right, I might as well get the, the moan out of the way. So, I told these on eBay. Guy waited four weeks. I don't want them anymore. Sent me them back. Bearing in mind when I sent them out, they're all in pristine condition, really well packaged. I've got this Hydra back. That's where it came to me. Smashed to pieces, completely chipped. Manticore, all broken. Rider broken. Um, I'll bring up the next unit I'm going to show you, which is these Witch Elves. Uh, now, originally there were 20 Witch Elves. Now there's only 10. Ten gone missing. But according to eBay, that's a tough titty. I've just got to refund you and just be happy. So anyway, um, it, Games Workshop brought out plastic witch owls, thirty-five pounds English pounds, just for ten. Absolutely ridiculous money. So I come up with the idea of doing base fillers, and I add these. I don't worry about these. I think somebody at the club gave me a couple of seekers. Demonettes on slashy themed things. So basically that is 60 by 40. So that takes up the base space of six witch shells, one at each end. That is um, 12 witch shells. I wouldn't have to, have to buy them. Bearing in mind there were 20 originally anyway. Uh, and then for the last few spaces I just put in crossbow men or whatever I had as base fillers. Fairly lean in at my club about that. So yeah, I got these back from the guy. Uh, I'd love to meet him one day in, in person. If fate is kind. I doubt it will be. Uh, so yeah, 10 missing. But hey ho, tough luck. eBay says you've got to refund it. you got to refund it. So that's that. They're my favourite unit. Of all time for Dark Elves, Blackguard. Uh, and this is my army channel on foot if I can get out yet. I painted these years and years and years ago when I first got into Warhammer. This was my first ever army. Dark Elves. Uh, and I did these, Blackguard, in a winter theme. Just to be different, so instead of being all purple, I can purple shafts for things. But yeah, I did them in a winter camo kind of thing. So a lot of people used to say, we use Black Guard for it, Shusha's better, but trust me, they're not. Black Guard are the future. Well, they were. That'd be plays anymore. <laughs> not my club anyway. So Black Guard. Then I had some Scouts. Oops. I used to use the, these are uh, Manfred's Van Flayers. From Dogs of War. Bad paint jobs. They're really old paint jobs. Uh, anyone remembers when these come out. <laughs> so that's how long I've had them. Uh, harpies. I've got some of the old style harpies somewhere, but I don't know where they are. They're in the garage somewhere. So I've got these harpies. Again, this one come back. Half the wing missing. It's not in the box. Not the best paint jobs. Harp is quite useful, taking out enemy artillery and stuff. Crossbowmen, winter themed again. Two units off. 
Uh, and I've got a load more, as I say, that I use for base fillers. Uh, I've got some Corsairs, but never use them as Corsairs. I always just use them as fillers or extra scouts. And then I've got a whole load of Dark Riders. Uh, now there's... Ooh, he's quite close. There's nine of these. There was ten when I sold them. It's only nine now. <sighs> Nothing I can do about it, apparently. eBay says you've got to refund it. So nine of them. I suppose I could put the uh, that in there to make up ten. As soon as I ain't got a rider anyway. So that's Dark Riders. I've got a couple of bolt throws, one of which is unpainted. Uh, a couple of crew, they're just scouts, of course there's. And then I've got a painted one. All painted years and years and years ago. So, I need a lot of, this whole army needs a lot of TLC, to be honest. Um, let me just show you, because I was quite proud of this rider. I can find his head. So this is the Manticore rider. Um, I did do quite a good job on his face. Get that into focus. So, yeah, but it's all broken now, but at least I've got the bits to glue him back together. Got an assassin here. Don't know what's happened to his base. Gone. So that is it. That is my old hammer, Dark Elf Army. Uh, or what's left of it. As I say, this is only about, about a third of what I had. I sold all the rest. Sold everything on eBay before Age of Crap Mark come along. They killed fantasy for me forever. Um, but I dare say I've got um, maybe 2,000 points. I don't know. But I haven't got any of the old army books. I must have sold all of them as well. So I can't remember what edition Stig said he was going to use for these. Um. So I can't actually plan an army list to see what I've got. <laughs> and I can't remember what it was you used to have to have two core or three core and then you're allowed so many elites and heavies and whatever. I can't remember how it all used to work, to be honest. But anyway, that's my old hammer army. Bit of a rant, bit of a moan about eBay. I used to sell quite a lot of stuff on eBay. Uh... But when I had to refund that, it really, really did annoy me. Um, and I carried on selling stuff. I stopped selling stuff now. But about a year and a half ago, not December, just gone December before that, eBay suspended my account again for the same transaction, saying that I hadn't paid it. Uh, although I have, because they opened my account up before after suspending it because I had to pay it. And this has been going on for over... A year and a half now I keep phoning them and they say oh yeah we'll sort it out and they never do and then I phone them back and say oh yeah we'll sort it out this time within seven days nothing happens and this has been going on and on and on so just be wary if you do sell stuff on eBay that people can return it however they like with bits missing and you as the seller end up refunding it all and there's sod all you can do about it anyway that's enough of me moaning it's only because i'm ill i've had man flu so yeah uh i've almost finished painting up with japanese but i haven't done anything this week because i've been ill uh, but they're getting a run out tomorrow so hopefully on monday i'll let you know how they got on in their first two battles um and I'll do a, a showcase of, of what I've got painted, which is pretty much all of it. It should all be done, the first thousand points anyway. Uh, although now I'm thinking I need to make some changes to the lists. Um, some things didn't quite work as well as I hoped. 
Um, but I don't want to give too much away because it will spoil the next video. So um, there'll be some stills at the end. Um, sorry I've gone on a bit in this video. There's quite a bit to show you. And I wanted to have a little bit of a moan about eBay uh, and the dangers. Things you will, uh, you may or may not come up with. I don't suppose that's too bad a paint job, considering I painted it all them years ago. It's quite good, isn't it? Mm. Anyway, they need a lot of TLC. I haven't got the army book either, which doesn't help. Uh, but yeah, I just want to do this as a video response. I promised Stig ages ago that I'd do it. I just have not got around to it before. So here it is. Still to the end. Watching all your stuff. Not commenting as much as I, I normally do, because uh, I have been quite ill. Uh, but I have been trying to comment. Um, and yeah, I will catch you on the next one. Bye for now.